Okay, I'm glad you're here because you definitely needed to know how to preserve lemons because who doesn't need to know how to preserve lemons? We actually have a lemon tree and we get too many lemons every year. So our method is to juice them and then freeze the juice because we don't know what to do. That's a good idea. We put them in the big cube trays and then we just have lemon juice though. We don't have lemons, right? Is that the idea here is preserving the whole lemon? Correct. Perfect. But it's preserving it in the rind? Yes. Okay. Yes. There's different ways to do it, and this is the way we're gonna do it because we want the whole lemon. So we're just gonna make a brine, and it's just salt water, essentially. Like for what a it is. So it's, yeah, or pork chops, because I use a brine for them. Cool. I use my lemons for chicken piccata mm -hmm. and for lemon drop shots. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if we're being honest. keeping it real. Keeping it real. We're gonna use. And lemon bars. Oh, I love lemon bars, oh my gosh. So we're gonna use the pink Himalayan salt because the white table salt has a filler and it'll leave sediments and stuff and so this is just a much better salt. So it's a tablespoon for every two cups and this is a four cup jar. And really it's good to use filtered water and y'all have your water's filtered at this sink. It is, it is. So that's the cold water is. So that's what we're gonna do. There you go. And we're using our oil separator because our measuring <laughs> cups are in the dishwasher. Right. So just use what you have. That's right. Exactly. And it's probably going to take a few of these. And we need to get our lemons out, too. Oh, oh. Maybe I need to put the cap on that thing. You think? That's what the spout's for, you nerd. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have one of these. Y'all fancy. <laughs> she poured it the side and said, I'm like, what is happening? Where did it all go? <laughs> all right, let's try it again. Whoa. Yeah. So we got this big jar from Walmart, actually. Mm -hmm. And it was cheaper to buy this one versus a canning jar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that'll work. Yes. Yep. And so the idea, though, we want to keep the lemons <laughs> below the water. So we're going to maybe weight it down with a plate and we'll show you that in a minute. Let's pour, just go ahead and pour this in there. It's not an exact science or anything here. But you'll be, I mean, you can keep these like a year. A the year. whole, yeah, the whole idea is that your lemons are um, ripe now. So that way you're getting them fresh, you know? Uh -huh. So I guess the only problem is you just gotta find somewhere to store this jar, huh? Yeah, it's a big jar. Can we just, can we just put it in the So we're gonna leave it on the counter for three days. Okay. And then after three days, you're gonna put it in the refrigerator. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And then once you go to get in it, use a clean utensil. Don't put your hands in it, things like that, because you don't want to contaminate anything. Okay. No contaminating. Not sure. And so a lot of times you're buying your lemons like this. Yeah, a little soap and water. Because um, you're going to wash, wash, just like you would a dish. Okay. And then you're going to rinse them good. But a lot of times people are buying their lemons and they may have some coating. It's a wax coating on them. A lot of those fruits have that natural wax coating anyway. But these are fresh yes. from the tree. But we're still going to wash. We stole them from a lady's yard. We Let's did not that. steal them. We had permission. <laughs> Goodness gracious. We should probably send her a thank you card or something. That she was nice. Or something with lemons. Try, ooh, those lemon bars. Yeah. Yeah. And you can use that Redmond's real salt or the Himalayan salt. Okay, I think we'll um, go with this and see how much more we'll need, Scylla. And these are Myers lemons, in yes. case you're wondering. They're so big. They're huge. They're huge. And they're, That's why they're we sweeter than your jar. just regular These old store-bought yellow lemons. They're sweeter than that. And that's These why they make, make such great lemon drop shots. Yeah. <laughs> they make a really good lemon cake. How oh. comes I feel like my kitchen is inadequate because she has random Stop. things in her house <laughs> that normal people don't have. Okay, so here we are. So, and the idea is you want to really press them into it. Okay, you're gonna dump water everywhere. Yeah, we'll, we'll take some out. And so, again, but let's find, we need a weight. 
that will Don't never it. get it out. <laughs> I like it. Your hands clean. Look at that. <gasps> Perfect. But we can get another lemon in there, don't you think? <laughs> There's space for another lemon. What do you think, Isaiah? Doesn't look it. super appetizing. It's lemon soup, man. I see that. Remember the the book Rock Soup? Was it Rock Soup? I think so. Okay, wait a minute. We got it. We we can get another. You know, right? I think we can. We're gonna try. He's not too big, right? <laughs> Heavy laughs. laughs. We need to wait up and they need to stick under the brine. Look at that. I think it's perfect, huh? It does. It looks good. I think we can. Uh, mm. Looks like it's below it. What do you yeah. think? Yeah, everything's below the water oh, level. Sweet. Yeah. Beautiful. Good job. Good job, y'all. <laughs> You're like, look what I made. Look. Yay. That's so good. <laughs> I'm putting that in the video, too. Oh, though. my gosh. <laughs> Thanks, Mama. You're welcome. All right, yeah. so that's how you preserve lemons. So you yeah. Keep, if you got some, like, some For like a ginormous, mutant-looking... Uh, lemons like we do, then you're good to go. So, Looks like you, might so you can buy them, but you can also do limes. You know what it reminds we'll, me we'll, of? We'll we'll juice those. Basically, yeah. yeah. It reminds me of like uh, Dr. Frankenstein's lab, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Chucking heads and stuff. <laughs> yeah. But you know, you can do limes. You know, for your guacamole. And so that pretty much anything with like a citrus yeah. rind can do that. Okay. Why not? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All right, yeah. so we're gonna um, we're gonna juice the rest of them, and then we'll freeze the cubes. Yeah. That's one of Abby gets in on that project, so we'll do that. That's fun. Okay. okay. Thanks, Mom. Welcome. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah, appreciate it. See you in the next one. Bye. Bye.